think I forgot. One block sky block, but I'm the largest mod pack. I know. It's been 16 years. No, it's been two weeks. That's still a long time. Let's go check out our base. And if you're new here, don't worry. I'm gonna explain everything where we're at. So make sure to smash like and subscribe for more quality content. Wow, here it is. What's wrong with the sun? Why does it look like that? <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, it's been a long time since we're here. This place is looking real nice. We got all our storage here. We got a random item blocks. We got our EMC block thing that we learned that duplicates items. We're actually gonna, hey, 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 bro. Watch your jet. I have a snowball gun thing. <laughs> It puts snow everywhere. It's quite deadly. We got our cookie jar where we put all our bosses and other things like a runner chest burster. Oh, yeah. We were trying to make a cage for him. We were going to put him here. We, we can do that on that th today's episode. We got our other alien knots right over here. This is the only animal we have. All our other animals died. We also have two skeloxes. Hey, where are you guys coming from, huh? Get out of here. We have our failed mom farm up there. But we can actually finish that or fix that today. Because with the EMC, EMC, we could actually make this all out of obsidian. Because the reason why there's so many holes is that keep, creepers keep on blowing it up. Hi, how are you? We have floating vindicator, all this random stuff. And that's vodka. Only on the Saga One channel is vodka dripping from a mod farm and going all the way down. We actually got this party pickaxe and it mines life really fast. What's this? Pig fusion. We got a pig now. Uh, we also have permanent all these things because for some reason there's a there's a block on this island that's <laughs> that's emitting permanent radiation. So we're slowly dying. But I was reading the comment section on the last video. Guess what we have? We have two automatic break big brain thinking. Why not attach these to our item generator thing? That way we have infinite blocks. But I don't know where the, any of those blocks would go. I mean, I guess we can make more storage, or we could just turn all the M's EMC stuff so we can turn it all into obsidian i need to duplicate this obsidian if we want to make an actual working mob farm then we got to build it out of obsidian what could go wrong ah it's taking up all my cobblestone in order to make obsidian that's what i like to see because i don't want any of this i probably have stuff in my chest that are worth like Six billion EMC. Oh my god, a golden apple, 16,000? Well, that, those are some pretty insane numbers. How much is one piece of obsidian? 64, so if I put this in here, oh my, that's gonna give me a lot of obsidian. I hope this will work as a functioning cage for the the other alien. I don't think you'll be able to escape this. I mean, I guess there's only one way to find out. He seems pretty big, and I hope he's taller than two blocks, or <laughs> we might have a problem. He's either gonna escape, or this is gonna work out. Oh, nope! He is one block high. That is not good. That means I need to fill this in now. Oh, he doesn't seem aggro, though. There! Now, there's no way he can get out. I mean, we can punch him just to make sure. He doesn't even seem to care. Boy, if you don't get- Punching game doesn't even do any damage. He just kind of stands there. Well, now that's taken care of. I guess we try to figure out how to set up these guys to give us infinite blocks. I mean, technically, we always get into infinite blocks, but now these guys could just, like, keep on mining. Oh, that's what we could do. We duplicate chests, and we duplicate iron. And when we do that, we could have hoppers going all the way around and just putting all the stuff in chests. Is this big brain or what? Time to make the path for all my chests. I can make it out of something that looks nice. Like this, Guardiana Stone. It's only one EMC. What is this? Is that a blood moon that is rising? Well, that might not be be good if things start spawning i think i see things moving up there i don't know i guess we'll see i'm just starting to clear this out because that's where i'll put the hoppers and we could also duplicate hoppers so technically speaking if i were to put a block here and there and put the block breaker does it go sideways or only oh it does is it breaking it it's doing it it's breaking the block and oh blood moon oh my god get away from me that is the biggest chicken I've ever seen. Hey, bro, watch your chat. Where's my Escanor axe? I don't have it anymore. Take my snowballs, you ferocious chicken. Goodbye. Things are gonna be coming from that mob spotter. Let me break this real quick. No! I didn't grab it. My inventory was full. And great. Now we have mob spawning here. A freaking dragon or something. It's okay. Yeah, what What are you? Does this block breaker have EMC, by the way? It doesn't. Maybe we can craft it? I gotta be very careful. I can't lose that one. Oh my god, it's so cheap. 
Well, okay, we can end up crafting more. We just need one more. Well, I guess you could set up multiple block breakers. All right, well, let's get those hoppers as long as we're not gonna be interrupted. I'm trying to look for one piece of iron. Oh, <gasps> we do. All right. I just need to duplicate this and then we can duplicate hoppers. There we go. And it's so cheap. Well, let's look through our chest and find everything with an extremely high EMC value. Like this, 16,000. What's the EMC of one hopper? 874, that's pretty expensive. So we want a hopper to be able to go here and then connect to all the chests over here. That seems like a plan to me. Huh, you see my plan? So if I were to break this, oh, it goes into the hopper. And we'll have these hoppers and they'll go into the line of chests that are over here. And then we can take that and then put it back into that chest in order to duplicate infinite items. Now we just need more hoppers because we are out. All right, I'm gonna search all my chests, grab everything that has a high MC. Oh my God, hyper fluid receiver has 1.26 million EMC. <laughs> That is insane. This is probably a really good item. And that is why we're going to turn it into a hopper. <laughs> give me that 1.2 million. How many hoppers is that going to give me? Oh my God, it's just going to keep on going. All right, I think that's enough hoppers, man. <laughs> we got a lot of EMC stored. Hey, hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. That is one big boy alien. Well, I don't know where the face hugger is. Oh no, there you are. Oh, you're a lot bigger. That's not Notch. Is Notch still down here? Huh? Oh, okay, he didn't grow up. What is this? That's the biggest alien I've ever seen. Are you mad at me? No, oh, they never seem mad at me. Do you want to go inside one of these boats? Would, uh, do you want to become a boat brother? I think he wants to become part of the boat. Come on, join the boat. No, no need to roam around. Come on, get in the boat. You know you want to. Oh, there we go. I did it. I've captured myself a giant alien. What could go wrong? Boom. I'm starting to create like the hopper system and then it's gonna connect to like layers of chests. And then, then those chests will have more chests and it will just collect more and more and more items, like infinite items. Hey, get away. I'm trying to explain things here, man. I need to find a light source though. And while I was trying to find a light source, look what I found. Cobblestone generator, 80,000 EMC. But it says cobblestone generator. I understand that. That's English. Only hold 64 blocks, make one cobblestone block every five ticks. Just imagine if I connect this to our uh, solar panel of infinity, infinite cobblestone, which also means more infinite EMC. Bro, we are getting rich. I found a light gray tallow candle. Thank you, with 72 EMCs. I'll take some candles, give it to me. 64, baby. Now we're set. Look at that. It's not gonna be the most efficient way, but it's definitely gonna work i just lined up all these hoppers into all these chests so these will fill up first and then all the rest of these i can even put a hopper at the end of these and then put it into uh this emc chest and then constantly make non-stop emc so if i put this block breaker right now if i take this well i gotta be very careful I, I cannot lose this i mean i can make more actually turns out they're really cheap goodbye amber juice i'm sorry i take this place block there and boom it's gonna start breaking it right yeah, and it's going into the hopper. And that's going in, okay. And that should go into the first chest, which is these right over here. Yo, sentry turret, whatever this is, matter condenser, artificial RF, learning book, doge 101, <laughs> the gingerbread man. Oh my, this should be illegal. The question is though, if I were to put, I don't know, this block in here, does it automatically go in here? It does. But if I were to put, I don't know, one piece of gold here and then put in these stones, okay, it's making it and I put in the stuff there. So it's taking the wood. Okay, it does work. That means the wood was being taken and it was being being turned into uh, gold and we can make our mob grinder finally oh yeah i have all these candles now so uh no more nighttime are uh, you a little lonely mr dragon oh huh? i mean alien you have a really big head did you know that <laughs> ah, look at the top of his head well I i'll leave some scented candles here for you okay so you don't get lonely it already filled out all these chests look at this it's all filled out and it's already on this top one we're even getting all this better armor and a stone bowl an axe of stream i mean if you think about it i don't even need a hook get up there's still like 1 million somewhat emc in this thing isn't there oh the stuff that doesn't have emc though won't go in that's interesting so if i have to take this out 
Okay, but what did I just get? Oh, <laughs> basic solar panel. These are the solar panels I use in my hardcore world. They look really cool. They actually look like cool solar panels. So the next step is taking all of this out and replacing it with obsidian, but I don't think we can do, do that during the nighttime. It's, uh, it's a little bit hostile during the night. I wonder if we could EMC water buckets and vodka. Oh, no. Oh, no, wait. Oh, no, our big alien died. He's been creepered. He's been ambushed from above. But at least we have this. <laughs> at least we have one thing that's worth. Working. Since this machine is going on, I think it's time to uh, fix our mob farm so we don't have to ah, deal with that thing. All right, get away from me. Just fly down. Just be with your people, please. Goodbye. Your people need you. Goodbye. I think we should just completely take this out. I mean, we got to change it all to obsidian. Oh, no. We got to wait for the daytime, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> we got to wait for the day. All right. Which is hopefully soon, or is it about to be nighttime? No, the sun is coming up. Oh, yeah. See? Oh, no. There is a creeper hat that has infiltrated the center of the base. Oh, that is not good at all. Is it stuck on the wagon? It's stuck on the wagon. Oh, no. That can do so much damage. I can't hit him or he'll instantly explode. Maybe I can fly away and then come back and hopefully despawn. Honestly, that is gonna be my best option. I'm gonna do that. Did it work? <gasps> it worked. I didn't lose my alien though, right? Yay, we didn't lose our aliens. Okay, we probably need to take up all like the vodka and stuff. Wait, is this vodka? What is this? No, that's neutral spirit. We gotta get a couple buckets. All right, machine, give me some buckets. Oh, okay, that is probably enough. And the final pieces. Yay! It's all gone. All my work is gone. How sad is that? We will now rebuild it. It will be stronger, faster. All right. First, I need a little bit more obsidian. So, uh, let's grab some EMC out of these chests. Oh my god. Where is it right now? Like, how far in? Oh. <laughs> let's hope we don't crash when we open the chest this time. Oh. <laughs> We should put a sign on that chest saying, breaks our game chest. Well, I got the sign in there. No touchy. But other than that, everything is completely full. Like the first six rows. Look at this. All of this is already filled up. Is this filling up? No, so that means it's on this side. It's already here. That's like 30 double chests. Let me just get all the cool items or a high EMC item and see what we get. Hey, leave me alone. I'm doing business. I'm joking. Stop, stop, stop. This has 4.78 million EMC. What even is it? Compressed netherrack? Let's give this netherrack to this machine so we can get obsidian. That's gonna be a lot of obsidian. That's gonna be a legal amount of <laughs> obsidian. I also got another realm stone, two TNT thingies, dark matter boots with also a lot of EMC, hydra skull, cool dragon chest plate, even a plasma caster, and another pet. But this one's all weird. What is that? Oh, it's in my hand. Oh, you're real. Ow! I thought you were a statue! Stop it! Goodbye. I think this should be tall enough. I don't know actually how tall. Oh, yeah, that's probably tall enough. Most mobs won't survive that height. Well, that looks kind of scary. Like an obsidian tower of doom. Let me also quickly put in some candles here so, you know, no mobs start spawning and blowing this all up. Well, not blow it up, but just like, you know, annoy me. All right, which of these don't hurt me? This looks like it's gonna hurt me. No, it doesn't. Oh no, I'm definitely on fire. Okay, what about carrot juice? Carrot juice does pretty good, except for this. Okay, that's not gonna be good. What if we move the carrot juice one even closer, like so? Now we got carrot juice in our mob spawner. Things are looking up. What's, this is molten dark chocolate. Is this a decent job? I think this is gonna work. Now that is epic. All right, everything takes it, and we go way drop into the middle. Now we just gotta fill in the rest of the mob farm. Okay, all right. I have successfully finished the mob farm. I mean, to some extent. Oh, wow, that's, that is very scary looking. Uh, nothing's gonna spawn yet, just because um, I left candles in there. How does it look on the inside? Voila! Oh, wow, that's, <laughs> that's very small. Do I hear things above? I put candles up there. No, 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 no. This needs to be all lighted up. Goodbye. Your people need you. 
Well, before I take out the candles on the inside, I probably want to put hoppers here and uh, I could put the Skyroot poison on top. I could poison them and then take all their loot. That could work out, right? Yeah, let's do that. At least have some sort of put that before we put in the poison or do that before we take out the candles so we don't have to deal with mob spawning while we're taking this all out. All right, let's see how this works out. <laughs> let's take out the candles. This is going to be a bit scary. Don't know if it's going to be extremely effective, but at the same time, it could be very effective. Maybe I need to place like trap doors and stuff so uh, they they don't just walk into the water. But you know, who knows? Let's see if anything spawns in inside. I hear things. Will they fall down or are they just gonna flow in the water? Oh no, I saw something fall down. We have one mob that is on the ground and we can't even attack him. So <laughs> we need to put like some sort of spike system on the uh, hoppers. How do you feel? <laughs> I lost like an hour of data, so I had to rebuild the entire mob farm. I know. And, uh, but I made some improvements. I put in the, the stone spike, but we'll see how that goes. Uh, I did not remove the candles. Let me show you the inside. I didn't make the liquids like go all the way. So let's see what happens when we remove the candles this time. Alrighty. This might work out a lot better. Ow. Those spikes definitely hurt. What happens if we go to the top here now? Is anything spawning? Big support? How can I help you? Okay, I'll just I'll just leave it alone and we'll we'll see if anything happens. I had to stop the automatic spawner thing. Don't worry. I just put it away right over there cuz uh I got some item that broke me completely. But we still have like 16 double chest of stuff to go through. So uh let's do that. Starting off with a mini gun. Sure. Oxygen compressor, that's good if we want to go to a new planet. A creative energy battery. Hey, and more random chicken. Chickens. We can start back our farm. A troll skull? Can I place it down? Whoa! That's freaky. What could possibly go wrong from spawning that? Dice of fate. We're rolling this. Yeet it. Oh! The dice lands on a one, and you notice that it transforms into something else. The fruit of Gristia. We are eating it. We cannot eat it. It is uneatable. It's a fake apple. A double chest pet? Let me guess, it's a double chest. I guess that's kind of useful. I mean, not really. There's backpacks in this game. Let's at least put in these, <laughs> our new trophy statues. I love these statues with the floating stuff. Now we have a floating sheep. We have a lot of eggs. I probably need to make a new area for my mobs to be. Yeah, look at all these mob eggs I have now. I need to be able to put these guys somewhere. We gotta make a we gotta make a play area somewhere. You know, it actually only seems fair if we make a cage. I can make it next to this one, next to the other alien. I just noticed that I can just choose a block I want to make it out of, like this yellow stained glass, and I can get a lot of it now. Boom, bada beam, bada boom, right? I accidentally opened the one that I'm not supposed to open. What did I just get? Nature's Ruin? Isn't this the most powerful axe in the game? Like, entirely. Like, out of all the mods. Yeah, it's part of the Avitaria. 99999 durability. Nature's Ruin. All right, that's illegal. Bro, there's so much stuff in this chest. Even a beacon. So many mobs, bro. Okay, I, there's too much to do, man. My brain is hurting. All right, let's, let, let me at least spawn all of these mobs in here, you know? And hopefully they survive. I just want to get my fence there we go hopefully they can't jump that and hopefully the alien doesn't kill them white a uh, you're safe gray ferret oh you're adorable jersey bull you're huge alfindo you're adorable all right oh i need to feed these guys don't i that's why they kept on dying okay it says well fed all right well you guys better teach me how to feed them or they're gonna die <laughs> oh my god if we have a beacon we could duplicate like a lot of diamonds. Yeah, let's just make a full diamond beacon. And let me try, uh, if this is an ax, that means, does this just like one shot wood? Oh, it literally just one shot. Oh, is our mob spawning working? Oh, we got cocoa beans. Maybe, oh, the items don't go through the spike. Okay, that wasn't very well designed. Oh, we got a lightning chabada hatchling let's let's just put that in there okay all right let's just uh let's just get a full diamond thingy i think we might wrap it up there let's get all these diamonds baby give me all give me all the diamonds give it to me all i'm getting myself a full diamond beacon today for what purpose i don't know i could even get myself more beacons i could have multiple diamond beacons for every single effect why not right watch this ready boom 
Look at that. 10 beacon. We have like 16 billion EMC in this thing. Oh, wait. Did we actually run out? Okay, we ran out. <laughs> it's it's actually only using the obsidian now. Okay, that might be enough diamonds though. Wow, I'm actually gonna run out of diamond blocks. You need more than a stack of diamond blocks for a full diamond beacon? Oh, that's a lot of damage. Let me just find something with like 16 bajillion EMC again. Sword of the Cosmos? Bro, is this the most powerful sword with the most powerful axe? I have officially become the most powerful human being in the planet. Oh yeah, sure. Project E, red matter boots. These are probably really good boots, but I don't care. I want diamonds. Thank you. A lot of people are probably screaming that I just threw away those boots, but come on. At the end of the day, what looks cooler? Red matter boots or a full diamond beacon? Exactly. My point has been made. Is it done? It's done. Full diamond beacon. And why not? We'll just have a diamond path going to the diamond beacon. Because, uh, rich boy check. Ha <laughs> ha. My base is, uh, very epic. <laughs> I think we're gonna wrap it up there uh, for today. We still have lots to do, like summoning our great and gender mobs or the titans. And we still have to figure out how to feed our, uh, our bulls. Because, uh, it looks like it's fighting the, uh, alien. Yes, they're very angry with each other. Okay. <laughs> and I guess our mob farm is not perfect. And now that we have the most powerful weapons really in the game, I guess we could go fight any boss. All right, until next time.